All those in favor say aye. 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 All opposed. Our motion carries seven to zero. Tuesday night, the city of Kyle voted unanimously to enter a water sharing agreement with the city of San Marcos for the next three years. Under it, Kyle will pay the city of San Marcos about $23,000 per month. Kyle District 4 City Council member Laura Lee Harris says this will bring about a balance. It's not like we're out of water or that the aquifer is out of water. It's a matter of just collaborating and adjusting those percentages to what is equitable. The city of Kyle has experienced an 8% yearly growth in population, all while its water supply has remained the same. The city of San Marcos, however, is expected to have a surplus in their water supply. Entering this agreement will keep Kyle from exceeding its limits with the Edwards Aquifer Authority. San Marcos has not grown as quickly um, as they were anticipated to grow. No. Push a button. The motion passes 7 to 0. San Marcos City Council voted unanimously to approve sharing water with the city of Kyle, but not without concerns from Place 4 City Council member Shane Scott. We asked them to mirror the same restrictions, information, commercialism, enforcement, as we do. They are required to meet or I exceed can. our requirements uh, and have been doing so, and they have a very aggressive enforcement program. Kyle City Council Member Miguel Zuniga says he still wants to see the city keep conservation top of mind throughout this agreement. I still want our recycling and our reuse water to be up at this level. No, even even though we were getting some water from San Marcos. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.